Hello everyone, today I'm here to introduce myself to you. I'm starting a video blog called Liz's Bookcase for the year 2020. I'm going to do a cookbook review of 12 cookbooks. Um, every month I'm going to reveal to you one of the cookbooks on the shelf behind me and I'm then going to cook five recipes from those cookbooks and I'm going to take you along for the entire process. Uh, why am I doing this? I have recently found myself in what I like to call a spaghetti funk. I feel like I'm eating spaghetti or tacos once a week and it's getting kind of bland around here. So um, I'm hoping to get back into finding uh, new flavors to bring into my kitchen. Um, a little bit more about me. I do have a culinary background, um, but I've always had a love for food. And um, I have two sweet girls and a supportive, loving husband and one dog and one cat. Uh, we live in a neighborhood that's located, uh, or it's, we have about um, 2,000 people in our community. And um, I shop at the local American typical supermarket right down the road from me. Um, and that is the supermarket that I'm gonna use for this challenge. Um, so you can connect with me on um, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, which I will link all of those below. And I have my own YouTube channel and I really would appreciate it if you would subscribe to that so that we can, um, so I can have your support. Um, I have for this challenge chosen 12 celebrity chefs so for the first year of my cookbook reviews and these are people that most of us know from the Food Network or the Create Channel or PBS and we've been drooling over the recipes and um, I'm going to see if I can bring them into my kitchen so um, these chefs do come from, uh, the ones that I have chosen do come from different backgrounds and cuisines, and I'm hoping that that's really going to give me the shakeup that I need. Um, some of the things I'm going to report back to you are, can you find these ingredients in a local, typical American supermarket? Um, or do I need to make a lot of substitutions? Uh, I can, can I produce the recipe with the instructions they give and the time that they give? Um, and or do I have a lot of leftover ingredients and of course does my family love it uh, so this is gonna be a wonderful challenge and I can't wait um, and I really need you to tune in at the end of the month because uh, there will be a chance for you to win a free cookbook it, to my most loyal um, fan uh, I'm going to send the cookbook that I'm reviewing from that month um, to you so um, Let's see, uh, also on January 3rd, I'm gonna give you a short tour of my kitchen and the basic cooking tools that I'm gonna use for this challenge. Um, so tune in then, and um, I look forward to seeing you on January 3rd. Until then, uh, tell me down below where you find your cookbooks or have you completely given up on cookbooks? <laughs> I'll see you on January 3rd.